गुड मॉर्निंग डे स्टूडेंट्स वेलकम टू मैथ्स क्लास सो टुडे पार्ट ऑफ पार्ट टू ऑफ फैक्टराइजेशन ओके सो इन लास्ट क्लास में हम ऑलरेडी लर्न हाउ टू फैक्टराइज द मेथड ऑफ फैक्टराइजेशन एंड द कॉमन फैक्टर्स राइट ओके सो फ्रॉम एक्सरसाइज फोर्टीन पॉइंट वन एक्सरसाइज फोर्टीन पॉइंट वन लेसन क्या New textbook exercise fourteen point one question number find the common factors of the given terms find the common factors of the given terms so um, third sub question first one third sub question okay first and second try to do it as homework fourteen p q fourteen p q plus comma twenty uh, eight P square Q square. Okay, listen. Fourteen P Q. Fourteen P Q can be written as two into seven is fourteen. Into P into Q. Okay, then twenty eight P square Q square. Twenty eight P square Q square means twenty eight. That is two into two into two into two is four. Into seven. Into p into p into q into q. <coughs> okay, so which is common in both two, right? So one two outside. Then the many seven seven is common, right? So seven and p then one q p into q. Inside the bracket, what? You will get one plus two p q, right? Two p q. So two into seven is fourteen. Fourteen p q inside the bracket. One plus two p q inside the bracket. One plus two p q. Okay. Hope this is clear. Then next question. Fourth sub question. Okay, four. That is two x comma three x square comma four. So two x can be written as two into x. Sir. Then three x square. Three x square means three into x into x. Okay. Then four. That is Two into two. Anything common factor? No. Okay, there is no common. That means can be written as so. There is no common factors. Right like this only. Okay. Then question number two. Factorize the following expression. Question number two. Factorize the following expression. Factorize the following expression. 7x minus 42. First one. 7x minus 42. Okay, children. So 7x that is 7 into x minus 42 can be written as 7 into 6. Children, which is common in both. 7 is common. So x minus 6. Am I correct? Okay. Then <clears throat> third sub question. Third sub question. Seven a square plus fourteen a. Seven a square plus fourteen a. So seven into a into a plus fourteen a can be written as two into seven into a. So which is common? Seven a is common. Take outside the many a plus two. Okay, a plus two. Is it clear? Okay. Then please note. Question number five. Sub question five. Question number five. Sub question five. I mean sub question five. Question number two. Sub question five. Two l square m. Two l square m plus thirty a l m. Thirty a l m. Okay, thirty a l m. So two into l into l. Into m plus 
30 can be written as 2 into 5 into 3. Okay, 2 into 5 is 10. 10 into 3 30. A into L into L. Okay, so which is common? 2L. L. Okay. 2L M common inside the bracket L plus 5 into 3 15. 15 A. Okay. This is the final answer. Then question number 9. Question number 2, sub question 9. Sub question 9. X square by Z, X square by Z plus X Y square Z plus X Y Z square, X Y Z square. Okay, sir. X square by Z, X Y square Z, X Y Z square. This question we can see that X Y Z is common. Take outside, inside the bracket. If you have to write the balance x on the other. If you have to write the y z, that will be y value. If you have to write the y z. Okay. Then, next one. Factorize a x square y. That is, I think, 10 to us. Okay a x square y plus a x square y plus b x y square b x y square plus c x y z c x y z ok listen common is x y is common right take outside x y is common so a x plus here b y plus here c is that okay this is final answer next question number three main question number three factorize that means regrouping x square plus x y x square plus x y plus 8x plus 8y 8x plus 8y. Okay, so that is a grouping which is common both x is common. Take outside, it doesn't matter x plus y. Okay, second term grouping this together plus 8 is common, right? Plus 8 is common. Take outside, it doesn't matter x plus y. Grouping together x plus y. So the next term is x plus 8. Okay, x plus a. So this final answer. Second sub question. Third one, second sub question. 15xy minus 6x plus 5y minus 2. Okay, this up. Grouping this first. That is 15xy plus 5y. Okay, then minus 6x minus 2. Okay, which is common in both 5y is common. Take outside. So remaining 3x plus 1. You want to 5y is going to be 1 now. 0 error. Okay. You want to do the minus 2 take outside. Minus 2 take outside. So it will become 3x plus 1. Negative 2 1 from the bottom of the final x plus 1. Grouping together 3x plus 1 into what? 5y minus 2. Okay. 5y minus 2. That is the final answer. Okay, so then. So next. Sub question 4. Third one. Try to do this over. Sub question 4. 15 t cube plus 15 plus 9 q plus 25 p 
25 feet okay listen so you can take this together 15 feet to 25 feet okay so 15 feet to plus 25 feet plus 15 cube plus so 15 plus 9 cube okay this is common in both 5 feet is common so remaining 3 cube plus 5 okay yes common is 3 okay take plus 3 outside so you will get 5 plus 3 cube grouping together you will get 5p plus 3 into 3 cube plus 5 okay next to the factorize is using identities next to the factorize is using identities factorization using identities so you all are familiar with identities that is what is a plus b the whole square identity a plus b the whole square equal to what a square plus 2ab plus b square right then what is a minus b whole square a minus b whole square is equal to a square minus 2ab plus b square Okay, then what is a square minus b square? That is a plus b into a minus b. Okay, then what is x plus a into x plus b? That is x square plus a plus b of x plus a b. Okay, these are the main four identities. Anyway, listen carefully. Factorize it using identities. First one, x square plus 8x plus 16. x square plus 8x plus 16. Factorize this question. Okay, factorize x square plus 8x plus 16. Okay, so, so actually this is a plus b whole square form, right? That means x square. Okay, all of you listen. So this is of the form a square plus two ab plus b square. Am I correct? Okay. So here a as what x? Okay, x the whole square plus two into okay two into x a is x into So two x into which number is eight? That is four. Okay, plus b the whole square. Here it is sixteen. So four the whole square. That means first and last. First and third means x plus four the whole square. Okay, x plus four the whole square. Okay, then second one. This is one of you. Four y square minus twelve y. Four y square minus twelve y plus nine. Okay. This is a minus b whole square form, right? So uh, using that expansion, a square minus two ab plus b square, right? So a square. That means which number the whole square? Two y. Okay. Two y the whole square. What is two y the whole square? That is four y square. Into two into a is two y. So two into two y, two into two y into three. That is twelve. Plus b the whole square. That is three the whole square. That means two y minus three the whole square. Two y minus three the whole square. Okay. Then next one. Next one is. 4p square minus 36. Factorize 4p square minus 36. 
Okay, listen. 4 p square minus 36. That means this is of the form a square minus b square. What is that? That is a plus b into a minus b. Right? Okay, that means a plus b. That is 2p square minus 36 is actually 6 the whole square. That is 2p plus 6 into 2p minus 6. Okay, so the complex is clear everyone. Okay, so study the formula and uh, so we can uh, do the homework also. Okay, thank you.